I've got a question for you. In your electrical career, how many lengths of mini trunking do you think you will install? Will it be hundreds or possibly even thousands of meters? And we all go to the back of the van, don't we slide out a length of MT2 and go to install it. But have you ever stopped to wonder how it is actually manufactured? Well, I did, and that meant I had to take a trip down to the sunny resort of Hastings, which was considerably warmer than this morning, in order to visit the Marshall Tuflex factory, where Darren gave me a tour and showed me how they make the trunkies I have in my hands here. Any trunking, very similar process to the conduit. We're using exactly the same materials as seen previously, using the recycled windows, cleaning the material, compounding it, pelletizing it, and now feeding it into the back of the machine. At the front of the machine, we can see the four strands to make our two strands of mini trunking. You'd call this the base and lid. The next stage of the process is the cooling process. As the plastic's still quite hot at this point, we've now got to cool it down quite quickly and form it so we get the rigid shape as it runs down the cooling tank. As I'm looking in there, I can see a copper pipe between the trunking and the lid. What's that doing? Gary, the copper pipe's there to allow sprays to be sprayed into the section as it passes down the tank. It helps to cool the product and keep the walls of the product open. So it's sufficiently cooled down at this point now where we can bring the lid and the base together, pass it through the rollers just to clip the lid on the base, and it'll then pass through the haul off. I wasn't expecting that, so I take it this is self-fixing mini trunking. That's correct, Gary. We can run this in two variants, plain or with self-fixing tape on it. Self-fixing being the most popular. So here it's just passing through with the tape being applied to the backs of the product. This product we're making is our Mini 2 range, probably the most popular, 25 by 16 mil. We do a range of sizes from 10 by 8 mil to 38 by 38 mil. Throughout all of our production processes, we'll quality check the product. So we'll take samples, measure the dimensions, check that we're within spec to the drawing, and then we'll also colour check the product. Confession time, I don't think I truly appreciated all the stages in order to make mini trunking. There is a lot of work that goes into our processes and manufacturing our products. Where we can, we try to put in some automation. This is our automated packing line for our MMT4 SF trunking. Once the bale or stillage is complete, the product's then shipped to our distribution centre. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see our free training package to help with your CPD in association with Marshall Tuflex, it's on the screen now.